Welcome to this look at crafting metal rolls on SnowRunner Season 3 on PlayStation with me, Mr. Silly P. In this hopefully fairly short video, we're going to be having a look at crafting rolled metal or metal rolls. Um, I am, I've done one on wooden planks, this will be metal rolls. Uh, for example, the Green Lake Paper Mill contract that I'm looking at at the moment requires bricks, cement, concrete slab, metal rolls. Now, if you go to the warehouse where it says there and you get there, it's requiring six and the warehouse says none in stock or only two or whatever. You may then find, okay, I've got a shortage, I need metal rolls, where do I get them from? Well, that's where the crafting comes in. You can go around to various different places and say metal framing and grab metal beams, but that doesn't give you metal rolls. I think you have to do the power, part, power plant contract first. Pretty sure you do. Uh, I did the power plant one, and it opened up the ro the rolled metal production site and another one. What was the other one it opened up? Can't think off the top of my head. So that's where you've got to come to. And what it requires is metal metal beams. So like I say, you can get metal beams for metal framing. But if you run out of those, and you still need rolled metal for some reason, or metal rolls, then what you need to do is come to this point here. The cargo creation zone number one is where you can actually craft metal beams. Now I have done a, a video on using the generators, fueling up the generator, and you create wherever it is you can create the various different creation zones using the fuel. And then you just refuel it, make more, refuel it, make more. So what I'm going to do is open the storehouse, and as luck would have it, I have one lot of metal beams left. So I'm going to load that on. And what I'm going to do now is from here, like I said, I could have gone to one of the building sites and gone to metal framing and grabbed some metal beams from there. What we're going to do now is head to the rolled metal factory and we are going to make some metal rolls. And that should be, I say should be, fairly straightforward. I'll see you there in a minute. I am using the modded Azov 73210 Teresque M181. Details will be in the description for the video, at least they should be. Now I've done the wooden planks crafting, but I haven't actually done this. So the metal rolls, as you can see, they're over to the side. What should happen now, if I open storehouse, it says metal rolls, zero in stock, and it says it requires metal beams. That's how you know what it is you need. I have metal beams available so if I unload the trailer now it's taken my cargo what's going to be interesting though is to see how many okay so what I've got then I can almost use it as a storage really because that's showing metal beams because I've just unloaded one there so the metal beams I could load it back on if I wanted to but I want to create metal rolls and it looks like it's a straight one for one so if I craft yeah Oh no, two in stock. So one metal beam will give you two metal rolls. So if I scroll across now, I can load up my two metal rolls. And it's as simple as that, really. Um, so if you need metal rolls and you get to the store and there aren't any, you need to craft some, you need metal beams. Wherever it is you get the metal beams from, it's entirely up to you. If you run out of metal beams for metal framing, you can create the metal beams yourself at the crafting points. Um, one set of metal beams will create two metal rolls. I can now use these on the job I was on. I hope you found this useful and informative in some way, shape or form. If you have, give us a like. If you don't subscribe yet, please do. If you want to leave a comment, feel free. And if you want to share this video, then please be my guest. Whatever you should choose to do. Thanks for watching.